in the Twin Cities now, hockey fans have one more reason to slap the glass at Grossinger Motors Arena in Bloomington. Yes, WMED's Brianna Rittman attended a press conference for the Bison today. She's here to tell us what's new with the city's newest hockey team. Brianna. Yeah, Rebecca Thomas, hockey fans gathering at the Grossinger Motors Arena received a two-for-one special with the announcement of the Bison's NHL affiliation and the introduction of the head coach. At a press conference on Thursday, the Bloomington Bison announced its National Hockey League affiliation with the New York Rangers. This affiliation means more than just games. It's about fostering community spirit, creating jobs, and boosting our local economy. The Bison had more than one announcement to make. Philip Barsky is the team's inaugural head coach. Barsky comes to Bloomington from the Canadian Hockey League where he was an associate coach for the Barry Colts. With you supporting our players and our organization, what I believe to be true is that we're teaching ourselves and we're teaching your children to chase their dreams because that's what our players are doing and that's what they're going to be doing here. Also at the press conference, a moment of silence was held for Scott Allen. Allen was the Vice President of Operations for the Bloomington Bison. He died Monday in a car accident. If you knew him, he, tremendous person, full of energy, full of enthusiasm, just a great guy, great with the fans, great with the kids, great with the players. The Bloomington Bison is a team in the ECHL. The affiliation is a five-year agreement creating an avenue for players to reach their goal of playing in the NHL. The thing that I'm most committed to is developing young hockey players and I'm committed to seeing these young players live their dream and make it to the NHL. Now did I say a two for one special? Let's make it three. Behind me is a picture of Stefan Mateau. He is known for scoring the game winning goal in double overtime for the New York Rangers in the 1994 Eastern Conference Finals. Now that clinched the Rangers spot in the 1994 Stanley Cup Finals, which they won. Now Mateau gave words of encouragement and signed a few autographs today following the press conference. Rebecca, 